Hello beautiful glam fam, glam girls, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, welcome to my channel. I'm Gabriella. I do all types of videos, so I hope that you stick around. So this is going to be a Rose Gal haul. So Rose Gal is one of those websites that is similar to like AliExpress. Um, there's a few of them where you can get all types of things, beauty, clothing, house, kitchen, just all types of things, really, really inexpensive. They do take a while because they're coming from China to get to you, but most of the time it's worth it because you're getting something super inexpensive. And they also have like really cool different products that you don't normally find just randomly in stores. So I have a haul here and um, it's all random things. It's a mix of everything. So first I want to say that um, a few of these, a few of the items that I ordered did not come. Um, they they do come in batches sometimes you'll get one order or one package and it'll be like three things from your whole order sometimes it's just one thing so that's some of the reason why it takes so long to get everything so so I have a pair of earrings here that are really really nice they feel really nicely made they're super super cute so they are like a amethyst and diamond silvery rhinestone earring super super pretty drop earrings they feel really nicely made they do not feel cheap at all and they were super inexpensive really really like them they have a silver back to them and you can see they don't look plasticky they don't feel like really really cheap I feel like you could get these at forever 21 for like ten dollars like they feel you know feel good they don't feel super super cheap so I thought these were really really pretty and I'm happy with them none of the rhinestones have come out um, they look really good they don't feel super cheap I got another pair of earrings that I thought would be really fun for the summer just to wear to the beach with um, your bathing store to the pool just to kind of complete your ensemble for the summer and they are these hot pink flamingo earrings and then the part that goes in your ear here is a white and black little circle and then that's what the back looks like and these are completely plastic when they came this one of them was broken um so i had to glue it back together but now they're fine i mean i did have to manually glue them but they are very very cheap these are not kind of fancy or expensive earrings at all they are completely plastic this part up here I had to glue back together and then this one here you can see the leg fell or uh, broke off right here there's like a little mark and I had to glue the leg back onto the earring so yeah these are really really cheap but again they were probably like a dollar so it's like one of those little niche things that they're not like super necessary but they're cute just for the summer and for a dollar yeah I had to glue them back together but it wasn't a huge loss okay, the next item is a kitchen item so weird but I thought this would be cool I wanted to try it for like when I make breakfast so it's basically this silicone mold that you use for making pancakes and it's really 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 hefty it doesn't feel like it's gonna break or snap i haven't used it yet i wanted to show you guys before i ever used it and like i said it's just like a silicone mold and you're supposed to be able to just put this like down into your pan and then i guess pour um your batter and then you could use it for different things whatever you wanted to cook that would um that you want in like circles i guess um eggs pancakes whatever and it's supposed to be a nice mold for them so i haven't used it yet like i said but this is what it looks like feels pretty good um but the truth will be in how it works if you've ever used one of these let me know what you think because i've tried using like household things to make things into circles and it never works so i'm hoping that this actually does the trick the next thing is super random is a shower curtain and it comes with the hooks and um 
I have like a beachy theme in my shot in my bathroom. Like we have a, a shower curtain that has like seashells and like beachy things, but it's not like super cartoon beachy. It's very like grown up. So um, when I saw this online, I was like, oh cool, it's a whole like beach scene. I thought it would look really nice, but it in real life it's very very cartoonish. Um, so this is the the top, and basically it's like a palm tree. You have like a palm tree little situation happening and then the leaves so then as you go down you have the palm tree with the sky and then the bottom is the actual ocean and then it goes all the way down to the shore which is the beach so yeah um it's cute but i feel like it looks very cartoonish i don't know if you're into stuff like this, then you'll like it. I mean, it's a regular shower curtain. Um, it's not plastic. It's like that, uh, what is that, like a vinyl, I guess? I don't know. You know, like that kind of material. So, um, it's not particularly amazing quality, but it's also not horrible. I just personally think that the look of it is very cartoonish. So, not super into it, but it's a working shower curtain and it comes with the hooks. Um, it wasn't that cheap either though, so mm. And then the last thing is a swimsuit So the clothing the plus-size clothing does go up, most of it goes up to like a 5x But a 5x on these websites is normally like a 2 or 3x so you do have to size up So that's why I usually will go with the 5x and if they have a sizing chart with the inches I will look and usually you can see that like a 1x is really a medium and then a 2x is really like a large or something like that so I got the 5x in this swimsuit love the pattern I thought it was so cute so this is the top you can see it's really really big I would say this is probably like a 40 double D it's pretty big um so my problem with the top is that the padding is very 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 hard and it almost comes to a point and it doesn't mold around your boobs at all like it's really really hard and when you wear it it looks very pointed it gives almost that 1950s pinup super pointy boob look which I'm not into um, I guess if you don't have boobs then it would give you the look of boobs but if you already have boobs then it's like it's a lot <laughs> Um, and like I said, it's really, really hard. It doesn't feel like f fitting to your body. It just feels like a bra. It doesn't feel like a swimsuit. But um, if you're into that, then you would like that. Uh, personally, for me, I don't like how hard it is where it feels like I'm wearing a full-on push-up bra. But the uh, actual look of it, the color is really cute. It's like a sky blue, and then it has like pink and purple jellyfish all over it. Um... So this is the bottom. The bottom I thought was so cute because it has like little ruffles on the side. So you can see right on the hips there's like these little ruffles that give it almost a peplum effect. And it's a nice like high waist. But it's ill fitting. Um, when I put it on it just didn't fit my body the way I liked it. The way I like things to fit. But again it's because it's cheap. So it's not made perfectly for an hourglass or curvy figure. You know, it's just big. It doesn't really have any coutureness to it where it actually like fits the shape of you nicely. I feel like if maybe you don't have exaggerated hips like I do or you're thinner, then this will look really cute on you. But for me, just the way my body is, it just didn't work out. But it's really, really cute and it's a nice material. It's stretchy. Um, I don't think it's too bad at all. I would actually try buying other swimsuit from there, swimsuits from there in the future. Just maybe not a two-piece. I might try like a one-piece. I don't know. But it's really, really cute. Love the ruffles. Love the little jellyfish design. I thought that was so cute because I've never seen a swimsuit with this cute little pattern and then the ruffles on the bottom. So I was really into it. Again, this is a, a 5X, it says. So this is like a... It, the bottoms look like they are a like a four or five x they're pretty big but the the thigh circumference here just i don't know it just didn't work out on my body the way i wanted it to but it's cute um yeah so that's everything 
hope you guys enjoyed this video i will see you in my next and i will leave the links for any of these products if you're interested they will all be down below and the website will be down below as well thank you guys so much for watching i love you stay glam 